Hi, Pisces. It's Jeffrey. It's uh, bright color. February. This is the reading. This is the Torah reading. February 12th through the 19th. Um, go where you are led. Go where you are led. So I, you know, what I, I feel like it's, uh, you know, you're gonna, what are you going to sit around and wait for someone to lead you somewhere? No. Um, it's like you have a thought or you have an instinct, or you have a like a hit to go somewhere or to do something or call someone or to uh, apply for a job or then go with it, totally go with it. I know sometimes I'm, I say to you things like, you know, oh, your intuition isn't everything, you know, it's just your feeling, la, la, la. Okay. Um, and sometimes that that's the energy that I get. This one is like, go where you're led. But what I mean by that also is like, let's say somebody invites you to a movie, just for an example. And it's like, your instinct says, yeah, I want to see that movie. But if your instinct says, mm, then don't, you know, go where you're led on the inside, not by what this one, that one says, but more like check it with yourself. I mean, you're invited somewhere and it feels like the right thing to do, then go. But if you don't, then don't. Yeah. Forward into the future. Clear vision, clear vision. End of a story, beginning of a new one. And, you know, saying no on occasion. If it doesn't suit your needs, it's okay to say no. I think maybe that's part of the message, too, is um, I have to write it down. Because um, I want to put a little thing. Um, you are lead okay it's hard to write far away does this um and you know the four of cups also i mean it's a gift right he either accepts it or he doesn't depending on how i read it but it, it's a matter it's emotional stability that's what it is so it's like well I feel like this, like I'm supposed to say there's a permission to say no if it doesn't feel right to you. Well, everyone is helping out here and, you know, at this party and it's like, you don't really like the uh, the host. You don't really like the theme of the party. Um, we really need your help. And, you know, it's like, you know, I'm led to read a book. I'm led to uh, take a nap. I'm led to uh, take a walk around the park by myself. I'm led to uh, go talk to the trees. You know, not everything that's offered, right? Yeah. And you might have to leave somebody out. I, so I read that a lot of different ways, but today it's like, oh, but, you know, everybody wants you to do it. And it's like, um, it doesn't really make me feel good. It doesn't make me feel whole. It doesn't make me feel like I'm part of it. And if it doesn't make me feel like that, then that's not where I'm being led. See? I'm being led towards something that's hopeful. I'm being led towards something that's fulfilling. I'm being led towards something that's maybe lucrative, but, right? Like the way that energy. Yeah. Well, four. You know, this is like, don't give it all away. This is his energy of like, don't give it all away. And it's like, it, it's really this, it, it's this energy of uh, go where you're led toward self-nurture, go where you're led toward what takes care of you, what holds uh, space for you, what, um, what's your highest good, what's your highest healing. That's what it is. And things that are not, because mm -mm. she, re she is done with the past. She's done with it. She has a vision of the future, right? That's full and complete. And it's not about saying yes to everybody. And if that means leaving some energies out in the cold, then that's what I'm going to do. Because I'm really looking very carefully and I really want to be very, uh, I'm going to honor myself. I want to honor myself. Yeah, you'll know when to act. 
Queen of Timing. Interesting, because the Queen of Timing, a lot of times I always say with her, I call the Queen of Timing. It's Queen of Wands. Um, you know, the cat knows when to pounce, but it knows when not to pounce too, when it's like a waste, right? Cats are really, really good hunters, right? And they stalk and they wait and they, you know, until the right time, not 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 before, not after. Well, everybody says you should do it. It's like, that's nice. I'm led, you know, by me. And that's where I stand. You know, it's about being empathic, which you are, but being empathic to your, toward yourself and sympathetic and compassionate toward yourself first. Then, if it feels right, it's the right thing, then do. But you're allowed to say no. All right. Extended readings are available, are available for members for $1.99 a month. Please join. That allows you to watch all the extended readings for all the signs all month, which is well over 50 videos. All right. Blessings.